Nigerians are about to witness a new level of entertainment and information with the unveiling of the Catch Up Cruise magazine television platform to empower the people and uplift the nation. The Catch Up Cruise features were unveiled at a press conference in Abuja. John Tena has more on this report. With unique features like Anchor Stopover, Anchor Speak, Shopping spree, desktop computer giveaway, and many others. Catch Up Cruise Magazine Television is set to empower its target audience with great entertainment and information at the audience's fingertips. At this press conference, the CUC consultants unveil the features of the newly launched magazine television. Catch Up Cruise is well represented across WhatsApp group channels and communities, and uh, the following social media platforms. Uh, uh, that's talking about YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and X. Uh, we strongly recommend that you like and follow us across these platforms, and most important, order now and subscribe to CUC's YouTube channel. Anchor Stopover. On this segment of the program, the Anchor showcases and accepts of his daily experiences with different situations or encounters as he goes about town and out of station on personal and official crews. For instance, in a CUC's meeting episode, the anchor's stopover segment captures the anchor in a car battery situation where he finally meets with a car battery expert to his rescue. Prospective participants are informed to download the CUC mobile app from Google Play Store for free for a wonderful experience. There is also the CUC um, quiz session, which is a monthly generation of three simple questions, which is one question for each of the categories captioned home, business, and shopping, respectively. Participants, um, prospective participants, are expected to download the CUC app, register and answer the question of their choice from any of the established categories as many times as possible. Catch Up Cruise Magazine Television has a motto empowering the people, uplifting the nation. John Tena, ITV News.